Hello everyone, uh, this is Swartor Snoopy here, back with another Star Wars Zero Republic video. Today I have for you guys another Star Wars Zero Republic Gunnery Commando PvP episode. So if you don't know what the Gunnery Commando PvP is, it's basically where I go into War Zones as a Gunnery Spec Commando. I fight, see how the game goes, give some tips and pointers here and there. But in this episode we're going to be doing the first person challenge. Now what I mean is we're going to be zoomed in all the way, we're going to be playing like this, and it's going to be, you know, very weird, but at the same time, it's going to be really unique. But yeah, once again, guys, this is going to be a challenge video, and it's going to be, once again, it is definitely different and interesting. So I hope you guys actually enjoy this Star Wars Republic Gunnery Commando PvP episode. As always, if you guys enjoy these videos, then make sure to leave a like. And if you guys want some nice gaming glasses, then check the links down below. No scope gaming glasses, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I will see you guys in the war zone but yeah guys we're in a fight right now so let's just go ahead and see how this goes man it is just completely weird just seeing you know all this in first person so it's like you know this is what our character would see honestly you know just constantly fighting players just seeing what they're doing and it also is a bit weird because of the fact that you can't really look behind you that well when you're in first person so all right there we go let's go ahead and take that person out right there all right they do have a sniper over here that's gonna try to escape so i'm just gonna go ahead and stop them Go ahead and put on a shield just to stop it a bit more. Alright, so he's kind of trapped because he still has that net, so there's no escaping. Alright, there we go. Looks like he's dead. And then, of course, we do have a Marauder. Looks like I'm kind of out in the open right now, so I might just go ahead and try to leave. Oh, man, I cannot even tell what's going on right now. I think that's the struggle of just playing in first person is also the fact that you can't really tell what's going on. So, yeah, I don't know. This seems like a really fun challenge. Hopefully, it's not messing with your guys' eyes. Just for the fact that you know... Everything is, after all, in first person. This game looks very different in first person. Alright. So we do have an assassin right here. He's trying to do some stuff. He's getting knocked back while well, just getting completely obliterated. Alright, so it looks like he's going to go ahead and resist that. So now it's my chance. Go ahead and strike him down and kill him. Alright, there we go. And then, of course, we do have uh, that guy right there. Then we have another Sork. Uh, once again, let's go ahead and mess with them. Just get rid of the bubble. Alright, so it looks like they're kind of running over here. I'm just going to go ahead and just kind of free cash... Uh, free cast on them. I don't even know what I was saying there. Free cast. Uh, that makes no sense. But alright. We're just going to go ahead and uh, keep this up. Alright. So it looks like we do have a sniper. It looks like they're kind of you know, deciding what they're going to go ahead and do right now. Alright. There we go. Let's go ahead and use that south right there. Oh, it looks like they might be trying to ambush us uh, from snow. I have no idea. I'm just going to go ahead and see what I can do. Man, even in first person, you cannot see anything. So... It's kind of like, you know, with third person, you're kind of cheating, but now you can really see nothing. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and just try to actually attack this guy right now. I'm going to go ahead and actually leave in a second. Let's go ahead and just mess with this player right now. I have no idea what I'm doing personally. I'm just trying to attack them. Looks like he's kind of, you know, running out of options, though. So let's go ahead and just continue to just, you know, not really attack Snow, but I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, it's a just kind of... You know, try to work uh, towards going uh, towards, oh yeah, just try to go towards snow itself. Looks like they're currently attacking grass, uh, so we might have a stone in the bag, not going to lie. They need help, so I'm just going to go ahead, you know, go for snow, not snow, I'm going to go for grass myself. Yeah, because it's already taken, but it's alright though, we do have a snow, of course. Uh, so I'm just going to go ahead and you know, try to stay at snow, considering the fact that now that we have that, it's alright though. Yeah, because it's still pretty even, not going to lie. So, let's go ahead and see what they're going to do. Alright, defend ours. I mean, at the same time, I don't really care because of the fact that we did have an opportunity. And it seems like they might have overran grass. So, it is kind of in our favor still. We still are doing pretty well, not going to lie. So, it looks like they might be coming mid. Alright, they are. So, let's go ahead and do that. Looks like that guy just got obliterated himself. So, yeah, we're going to need some more help at mid, not going to lie. Yeah, we are going to definitely need help at mid. Alright, I'm just going to go ahead and say mid. I know that there's some snow, but wow, this is just terrible when it comes down to playing without, you know, first person. This feels really strange. And then you just go ahead and, you know, press on it. And now it is, uh, yeah, it's just here once again. Alright, it looks like, wow, they are just going straight for snow now. So it looks like uh, mid is kind of being abandoned by their team. It looks like they're trying to take on snow itself. So I'm just going to go ahead and run over here. What does that player Does that player have absolutely no gear on? Okay, that, that person right there is a legend. So let's just go ahead and keep this up. I don't know. Maybe they might be doing a challenge. But, um, yeah, they are definitely the living legend. The title, as I currently have, they definitely need that title. 
Because that is definitely a living legend right there. Just someone that's going to constantly, you know, run into war zones without any gear and just try to be the underdog. Alright, so it looks like someone was trying to cap it, but they can't now. So I'm just going to go ahead, you know, mess with them a bit. Alright, so we do currently have a Sork right here. I'm trying to cause some problems. Just go ahead and run away. Knock them back and just see what we can do. We do need to kill at least one of them, hopefully. Alright, there we go. We did manage to kill one once again. I am getting completely overrun, though. Alright, there we go. Just go ahead and clean that one up. There we go. We're just completely cleaning them all up. Like, this is the cleanup crew, obviously, because it's like... I just kind of ran in here, and now I'm just cleaning up everyone. So, here we do. We currently have a Sork just trying to cause some problems. There we go. Looks like we did manage to uh, take him out. But obviously, I did clean up once again. I mean, I was the cleanup crew right there. I just kind of walked in when everyone was very low and just cleaned everyone up completely. All right, there we go. Just go ahead, get some heals to see what we can do. All right, so just go ahead and, you know, look behind us. See if there's anything there because, once again, when we're playing in first person, you can't really do too much. All right, so there we go once again. All right, incoming snow. This is not going to be good. All right, just go ahead. We can't really check to see how many there are. All right. So, alright, quite a few. Wow, they are just sending their whole team over there. They're sending the whole team. Alright, so it looks like they clearly want to take back Snow. So, I'm just going to go ahead, you know, just climb up here real quick and just try to take them out. Since I feel like that would be uh, the best idea. It looks like he just wasted all his defensives the second he was gang focused. But obviously, you know, he's still going to get taken down, sadly. Alright, there we go. We do have a... Uh, yeah, we do have a Marauder. It looks like I have someone behind me, but I'm going to have to sadly take out this uh, guy right here. It looks like he's still managing to take me out. There we go. Just go ahead and waste everything once again just to try to stay alive a bit longer. Just to go ahead and keep them from taking it over since we don't want that. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and just try to take out the Sniper right here. And I'm not probably not going to take him out, but I should just try to do something. All right, there we go. Just go ahead and actually attack. Yeah, I'm going to attack this Power Attack. Go ahead and just try to do some damage and take him out. But it looks like I am dead. Alright, so looks, let's just go ahead and see in the chat. I didn't see the callouts, but obviously someone is calling out. So, alright, yep, it was a bunch. Incoming mid, at least three. Alright, so it looks like they might be rotating. From, you know, after dying at start, they're going to rotate straight to mid. So, alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and go towards there. Alright, there we go. Looks like they have some snow. It looks like they're messing at snow, which is kind of helping us because that's causing problems for them once again. Alright, so we do have a Marauder that wasted all his defensives near the beginning, so... Yeah, that's pretty good. Just at the fact that, you know... Just at the fact that he's wasting all his defensives is going to help us in the long run, if you think about it. Alright, so it looks like we do have uh, this power attack as well. He's dead, and of course we do have another sniper. Just go ahead, and it looks like he's running away. So I'm just going to go ahead, mess with him, do some damage, hurt him a bit, and then kind of leave him alone since he's not really worth the time. Alright, so currently 200. Oh, yeah, 200 power left for them. So we're doing pretty good at trying to defend left and right, just defending all corners. Alright, so they do have a Sork that thinks he's going to be sneaky beaky like, but he is just going to go ahead and, you know, com completely caught. He thought he could just hide from us, but obviously he's kind of dead now. Wow, just completely crit and just got taken out. Okay, this assassin thinks he's going to escape, but sadly. He is stunned, and he is just getting completely wrecked. There we go. He is dead. So it looked like they might have tried to, yeah. looks like they tried to have two players go towards Snow. They had one uh, sorcerer as, I guess, say, a little decoy. I'm guessing that the assassin was going to go ahead and help him out, but he wasn't there in time. So I also heard some lightsabers, so that might be around somewhere. I don't think it's here, though. But yeah, he definitely got, you say, obliterated at the fact that, you know, we did have a sentinel on him while we did have a commando just, you know, me doing a bunch of burst damage. That did help a ton when it came down to that fight right there. Alright, so we do have another Marauder. It looks like he's not focusing me yet. So this is my chance to just completely do some damage. Alright, so it looks like I'm just going to go ahead and just do maintain it, you know. Just try to damage a bunch of people. Just mess with them. Alright, so there we go. We do have another power attack just trying to cause some problems. There we go. He's dead. And of course, we do have a sniper just trying to cause some problems as well. Looks like they're getting kind of trapped. They're going to go ahead and make a run for it. Looks like they can't escape now, though. All right, so there we go. We do have another assassin just trying to cause uh, some problems, but he is... No, he's out of time. So, there we go. Looks like if we only keep one at this time, we are going to win the match. So, that does help us a lot. Looks like I'm the first to be targeted right here. Go ahead and interrupt that. Just ruin the rotation itself. 
looks like I'm just getting my rotate. Oh yeah, my rotation ruined as well. Rotation, 10 out of 10. I have no idea what I'm saying, but you know, we're just gonna go ahead and go with the flow right now. Okay, let's just go ahead and hope to take that guy out. Okay, we do have a sniper right there. I'm not gonna get in his direct view since he could cause a bunch of problems if we aren't careful. All right, so we do have another Marauder right here. Just go ahead and get a nice crit. Just hit him with our assault cannon and just take him out. All right, so we do have, of course, another assassin just trying to cause some problems. All right, so it looks like we do have, yep, we do have a sniper over here just trying to cause problems. I mean, you know, I'm just going to go ahead and chase him off node real quick. This is going to be really stupid, but you know, I do want to chase him. All right, there we go. Looks like he is getting, yeah, he's getting trapped. So just go ahead and just stop him right there. Man, it looks like he is just running for his life. And, of course, we do have someone else behind us trying to cause some problems. So, no, that's not good. Yeah, I'm just getting obliterated now. Just got to go ahead and run away. Go ahead and just try to take him out. Just do as much as I can. All right, looks like I'm going to get taken out. Using all his defensives, I'm kind of out of luck. And there you go. He did manage to take me out. But that's okay. He did get the really nice jump on me since I can't really see behind me. If I likely knew he was there before, I could have maybe won that 1v1, but it's all good since we obviously did win this match. So, all right, so there we go. It seems like we did pretty well. Oh, yeah, we actually did pretty well. I'm not going to lie, considering the fact that it is in fir uh, first person. I mean, I honestly don't really play the game in first person. I know some people do it for the cinematic value, but definitely it's a bit interesting for a challenge, I guess. So, yeah, there we go. All right, so it seems like... We did manage to do 40 kills. Okay, yeah, 40 kills. We also managed to, you know, we died three times. That's all right. We did manage to heal, and then we did play the objectives as much as we could. Mainly because of the fact that we do need to keep everything on lockdown. Because if you don't, then, once again, I mean, just focusing on damage in a war zone is kind of stupid. Mainly because of the fact that you should focus on how you play the game itself and how it works out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this Star Wars Republic Gunnery Commando PvP episode. But yeah, guys, as always, if you guys enjoy these videos, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.